anytime somebody says the their Josh. nipple hurts, yeah. I'm like, you let me no tell idea. you. I know a guy. Is that the most painful? Thing? I know a guy oh, that pierced his cock. Yeah. I know a guy that did that. Prince Albert. Yeah. Good. Where Lord, though? Where? Yeah. It, I, it's I like didn't look at it, but I think it's, it's like right the, in the head. God. No. No. I think it's in the head, really? isn't it? I think so. <laughs> no, like the Prince, the Prince Albert right, maybe is at right. the base of the And then that's, then that's what it is. I didn't, I, I, I didn't look at his. So it's I didn't just look like the it. skin that's, it just, I don't understand. It, yeah, Why would you like, do All it? I know is, so remember that, so by the way, and, and keep the nipple story because I want to yeah. get you, back to that. Can you draw us a picture of where it was? I didn't look at it. But, but, <laughs> but, but all I remember is the, the way that the conversation came about is that it was the same going back to yesterday's stories about that movie theater crew, right? Right. And I talked to my friend yesterday, Frankie, where he wants to be referred as Barnaby and he is going to call in. Barnaby, he all right, Barnaby. Barnaby. Because Barnaby from uh, from March of the Wooden Soldiers was the villain in that. He, was, <laughs> oh, he says he liked to be called Barnaby. Um, so Barnaby was, oh, had a girlfriend sorry. at the time, and we were, they were sitting there talking to this guy, Brian, who had done the Prince Albert. And the girlfriend of Barnaby goes, I want to see it. And my friend goes, Barnaby goes, you want to see his penis? <laughs> and, he's, and she's just like, well, I want to see what, what that's like. And, he, and and Brian's like, can I show your girlfriend my my Balls, my balls, and he's like, "That guess." And I'm like, "I'm like, I'm going in to get a drink." <laughs> yeah. well, I would, I would want to see that too, because that's just, just, I don't even know where you would. do But that. if you're sitting there, if you're my girlfriend, and I'm sitting, there, and you t- ask to see another guy's penis yeah. in front of me while I'm there. It's, yeah. I'm like, no. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, Brendan and I show each other people all the time. We're like, oh, look at that hot girl. He's okay, like, look Dorita. at that hot guy. That, no, no, that's different. Yeah, that's, that's looking totally at different. that's looking at looks. That's looking but no, at because he would want to look too. We'd be like, yeah, show us your pe- your. So for a scenario, I said, hey, listen, I'm gonna okay, show you, you something. Live in a different planet. <laughs> yeah, and excuse like, yeah, me yeah. while I wish this out. Here's a two hand yeah. penis. What do you? Yeah. What do you, what, you? Your husband's gonna say, all right, good, good no, job. No, we would both want to see it. Because well, you're in a different again, relationship. Yeah, again, you don't live. But wait, I want to know Josh's nipple story. Yeah. So, okay, so I'm on senior week in high school. Uh, <laughs> and of course you were. We were in Ocean, Ocean City, Maryland. I want to know this decision. Yeah. Oh. No alcohol involved whatsoever. Oh, tons. Oh. Yes. Oh, <laughs> of course. And also some recreational narcotics. Oh, <laughs> and uh, so we... Kind of like not a children's show, man. <laughs> Yes, on the Caribbean. So uh, no, we're in Ocean City, Maryland. Oh, close. If you've ever been Ocean City, Maryland, it's it's great, and they do like a senior week, and they'll tell high school kids, hey, you can't drink, you can't party. What, uh, he's got somebody. What the hell's he doing? What are you doing? Addicted to yeah. his phone? Yeah. No, sorry, it's a it's a guest thingy. Okay. Don't worry about it. This oh. is not a big fucking deal. True. There you uh. go. So, uh, me, and I was there. There was 15 of us, eight girls, seven guys. We stayed in this big house. We were all drinking the one night, and it was like the second to last night we were there. And when we got there, everybody was like, we're getting tattoos. And I was like, I'm not getting a tattoo. Is that I'm, how you guys used to talk? Yes, at totally. That age? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I wore a visor to the side. <laughs> the whole weekend was just Sick total visor. jerk. Yeah. yeah. Drinking 99 bananas, chasing you said like extreme and being, a lot. Oh, totally. Wore yeah. no fear right. t shirt. Right. Did you yeah. you're, you're no fear guy? I mean, up until like did the seventh grade. Wear, oh, did you wear it party and all that crap? No, 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 no. What Never was, got what to was that. the other that one? What was the other the the, the the MMA shirts that people uh, were wearing? Tap out. We were oh, tap yeah, out yeah, guy. Yeah. Never okay. tap out. Never. And every what about Jesus? To the extreme. Jesus didn't tap. That's my favorite. Jesus didn't tap. <laughs> I, I didn't get, like, I feel like I wore No Fear, like, 7th, 8th, and ninth grade, and then I stopped. And you stopped. And then I never got into, like, the douchebag attire of the of the mid-2000s of, right. like, Ed Hardy, Von Dutch, right. you know, like, the no, trucker yeah, yeah. hats. We used to call whatever. it Von Douche. Yeah, yeah. correct. So, and that's where we made the douchebag anthem. Remember? Because it was, yeah. was based what, on but it. But what happened, though? So you then, you so, then you say to yourself, this all my buddies, like a good idea? Well, so all my buddies are like, yeah, get tattoos. And then... About the second night, everybody's kind of like, I don't think I want to get a tattoo. And then Thursday afternoon, my one buddy said, you know what we should do? Let's all get some pierced tonight. And we were like, yes, <laughs> we can take out a piercing. Right? So <laughs> so there's seven of us. Were you the only one? Shit canned. No, shit canned. Okay. And they even say on the outside of these places, on the boardwalk in Ocean City, Maryland, will not pierce intoxicated individuals. Right? right? Well, <laughs> they sure pierce intoxicated right. individuals. <laughs> so... They I have to do that. Two of us, three of us got our nipples pierced. A couple of dudes got their eyebrows pierced. One guy is his ear pierced. And then one of my buddies is a joke got his belly button pierced, <laughs> I, which I thought was hysterical. I, th- right? I think I think the guy who pierced his ear was probably the, did the best. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. The I got holes in my ears, but that's about it. Yeah. Yeah. So I get the nipple pierced, and I w- and we did like, Did we it went, hurt? Uh, yeah. From what I can remember, it hurt pretty yeah. bad. Then we went out hard all night, because we got it done at about like 11 p.m., 10, 30 p.m. So then we partied till like 3 in the morning. I blacked out, woke up, and totally forgot that I had my nipple pierced. Totally nice. forgot. How long I did woke, that stick uh, around for? 
What, the pain? No, no, the actual piercing. How long do you keep something in there for? Well, I'll, I'll tell oh, you okay. how, how it goes. Right, so right. I get a piercing. I was like, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? And you've seen my Did chest. Did you wake There's up like hair. bloody yeah. or something? Or no, it was, it just, was, it was definitely bruised. It was bruised. definitely very sensitive. And yeah. I'm pretty sure that they like nicked a like a nerve in the nipple. That feels because terrible just hearing about it. Every time I went yeah. like this, there it's was like, a shooting pain. The only thing worse than that is burning your nipple with an iron. Correct. Yeah. And that stinks. Only dummies do that. Stinks. So I get some peroxide and put it on and my one buddy's like, I think I'm going to take mine out. I was like, I think I'm going to leave mine in for a little bit, see what happens, whatever. So I go on the beach and all the girls are like, oh, it's kind of cool. And I was like, oh, yeah. Okay, <laughs> all right. Go. So I decide, to keep it. I decide to keep it in. So <laughs> come home and my dad, like the thing he said before he left was like, don't get any tattoos. But he never said anything about any piercings. So I was like, whatever. And you met my father. My dad is very conservative Catholic, especially his 18 year old son, who is, and my, my brother is a saint. But you didn't try, you didn't try to hide it? Oh, I did. Oh, okay. So, about two weeks later, I'm up in the bathroom and I come out of the bathroom and I already have a t shirt on with just a towel. My brother's like, What do you have a t shirt on? Like, why? And I go, Uh, well, I got my a nipple pierced. And he was like, What? Okay, <laughs> show me a nipple. So, so I see a nipple. He's like, That's the gayest thing ever. Like, That's just terrible. So, so. I was like, I'm going to keep it for a little bit. He's like, just take it out. I was like, nah, I'm going to keep it. So I'm working construction that summer, and it's so hot in Pittsburgh. I, find, I like, take off my shirt. My boss, who's the, like the general contractor, goes, what's that? Like from way across. I was like, what? And he's like, that silver thing hanging from your nipple. I was like, oh, I got my nipple pierced. He's like, you're fired. Did he really fire? <laughs> no, he didn't oh, okay. <laughs> So I totally forgot about it. And like three days later, I'm at home, and I'm mowing the lawn. And I had my shirt oh, off. Oh, no. And I'm mowing the lawn. And my dad comes home from work. And he comes, like, walking up. I think he's going to. And he just comes walking up. And he looks down. And I was like, oh, shoot. It was it. Gig it is up. It was it. And he just goes. Jig is up. So gig. And no, he right did not. Out. No. no. He ripped it out? No. Nope. that right out. Oh. No. He not did not. Oh. No. Bent nope. it out. Like, oh. shredded part no. of my nipple. I had to put super glue in there to, to like, abuse. close it. Oh, yeah. Of course it is. <laughs> no. But not an 18 year old. Now it's just an Italian house. No, 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 no. And you never got anything pierced again. Oh, though, no, right? no. Yeah. There's yeah, a, there's, like, you can feel in there like some scar tissue, but no, for the most part, isn't that yeah. so weird though that that generation like it just doesn't tolerate any of that stuff, tattoos and piercings, no. and now nobody gives a fuck. 